Welcome back. The search is on for some owls. They disappeared after a late night break in at a zoo in central Wisconsin. Somebody cut the locks on the enclosures at the zoo in Baraboo and set a number of animals loose. Stephanie Haynes talked to zoo officials now asking everyone to keep an eye out. The Ochner Park Zoo is back open Wednesday after a zookeeper's worst fears nearly came true. Notice that this gate was open and these two doors were wide open. When Ellen Gallagher arrived at the zoo Tuesday morning, she knew something was really wrong. Two otters and two great horned owls escaped. Their doors were flung open. Thankfully, two kayakers spotted the otters named Mitch and Mo in a park nearby. Ellen says the otters are so far happy and healthy and very friendly. Our boys probably swam right up to them out of curiosity. <laughs> but the great horned owls named Jerry and Linda are still missing and Baraboo police say they could have flown anywhere. Police say there's evidence whoever did this tried to let the monkeys and the bears escape, which is very dangerous. The zoo does not have surveillance cameras, but police say they have good leads. Whoever had done this had cut padlocks, jumped fences, cut all of our safety, all of our safety procedures that we use. Ochner Park Zoo is a free community zoo in Baraboo. It has four Mexican gray wolves, which Ellen is so thankful were not set loose. In fact, she says any animal let out of a zoo is really, really harmful to that animal. Most captive animals either were born here or are somehow compromised physically that they need to spend their lives in captivity. My biggest fear yesterday was that the otters would run out into the street. Oh, yeah. um, you know, the fears that you have if your dog or your cat goes missing, those are the same fears we had for them. Now, if you see these great horned owls, do not approach. Instead, call Baraboo Police. In Baraboo, Stephanie Haynes, TMJ4 News.